Hey guys, so this is Pete, and uh, in this video I'm going to go ahead and uh, show you guys how to weld and attach uh, meshes and stuff together. Alright, so um, yeah, we're just going to pretty much get started. Uh, so, first, these are mirrored, so I just went ahead and deleted the uh, copies, and now I'm dragging or holding shift. And, uh, now I'm going to mirror this this on the Y axis, so that way it's flipped around. Alright. And now I'm just going to move it over a little bit because there's a little bit more space. And I'm going to start welding uh, up these things. So let me go into the modifiers tab. And now go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and click the vertex selection icon then I'm going to select attach alright now I'm going to select the uh, model of the mesh that I uh, don't have selected and now, yeah, now the uh, mesh is attached to the uh, other mesh and now what I'm going to do is the more efficient way which is just clicking select uh, or selecting two vertices and uh, Pulling up the weld threshold, then click selected. Alright, uh, now you can do that uh, a lot. And what it does is it keeps all your vertices in a straight line, which is really good for uh, most things. So, you can see it worked out really nicely. And now, uh, what you can actually do is you can select, as long as you have a low threshold, uh, you can select more than like two. You can select two at like uh, that are parallel to each other or intersecting, I don't know. Um, and you can go ahead and weld them together, uh, like you're about to see. So I just brought my threshold down to like six, and I gotta make sure I can select uh, that. Oh, for some reason, my GMAX only does that. Alright, so let me go ahead and select it. Now, as you can see, a lot. Um, sometimes you get a little bit of a, an error or something, this way target weld comes in handy. Just select target and then you move it around to get the target. And there you go, uh, it's a full mesh. Um, it's not mirrored or anything, it's just connecting. Um, which makes it really nice. Uh, so yeah, hope you guys liked this tutorial. If you did, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll hope to see you guys later.